Wellness for Life is brought to you by Back in Motion Physical Therapy, Gottenborg Chiropractic Clinic, Mahabi Atwa Community Action Partnership, Lakeside Sports and Pain Clinic, and Thomas and Swanson and Zahn Attorneys at Law. When you think of homelessness, you often don't associate seniors with homelessness, but in Minnesota, the homeless population's fastest growing segment is seniors. We're talking with Marsha today from Mahabi Atwa, and they've got a senior homeless program here. I first want to talk to you about the numbers of homeless that you've seen in the Mahabi Atwa area. Well, we actually have served uh, 110 homeless seniors in our five county area over the past year. Just over the past year. Just over the past year, yes. That's wow. Right. So you started the Senior Homeless Program. How did you apply for that, and what, what is it exactly? Well, it's kind of an interesting story because um, I was having lunch in our break room, and the Senior Services Director came into the room, and uh, we started visiting. I w- have worked for 30-some years with the homeless in um, our area, and uh, she was interested in that program, and I, we were talking about it, and she said, you know, I think we should do something for the senior um, homeless people because I had told her that that was one of the fastest-growing populations senior and youth are the fastest growing so um, we got to visiting about it and I said well let's look for some opportunities and we found one with the uh, um, Minnesota Department of Human Services and I want to make sure I get the right name right aging and adult services division um, they put out an RFP for um, unique programs and um, we applied and we were lucky enough to be funded for two years and had the pleasure of helping over a hundred people last year 110 in one year. Wow, that is a lot of people. Now, Loretta, let's talk specifically about the services that uh, the senior program is helping. So tell me a little bit about how you get involved and what exactly you're doing to help homeless seniors. Okay, so uh, basically uh, when they call in or walk through the doors, I uh, basically do a screening with them. And then if it seems like they're going to be qualified for our program, I will do the intake paperwork. It's an application process that they have to complete. And from there, we just I sit down and visit with Marsha about the situation, and then we make a decision. And so what's involved with the program? Once you're, you're accepted into the program, what kind of services or benefits are, are homeless seniors seeing? Most of, most of it is uh, rental assistance or deposits. Um, could be possibly short-term rental, uh, one or t- two times a month possibly, or one or two times a payment for the rent. Utility deposits, um, apartment searching, searching for their apartments in their areas, as well as uh, case management. So if one was looking to apply um, as part of the Mojave Atwa Senior Homeless Senior Program, where would they go? Where would be their first place to, to start that application process? Basically, with myself, they would either call myself, and I would I can do a home visit. I can go out into their home, do a home visit with them to complete the paperwork, which is easiest for them. Um, or I can meet them in the office as well. And are there some certain qualifications that that you have to to meet to to get situated with this program? Yes, you have to be 60 years or older and 200% uh, of the federal poverty guidelines. Do you know it? roughly what that means, 200% of the federal poverty guidelines? For a single person, it would be $24,280 for the annual income. Wow. So in the last year, you served over 100 people. I think it was 110. Do you have a specific uh, maybe example of, of how this program has changed someone's life? Well, for a few of them, it's actually kept them in their home. Uh, Otherwise, they would have been homeless. If uh, we we wouldn't have assisted, they would have been on the streets. So getting them into an apartment is the other option that we always help with as well. Without this program, how are you seeing that some of these seniors who who may find themselves homeless, where are they staying? How are are they they getting by? Well, a lot of them are probably couch hopping, uh, living with relatives. Some do have their own homes, and others are basically... um, I would say most of them are couch hopping or living in a shelter. We've helped women in shelters as well. The Senior Homeless Program is available in the entire Mojave Atwa area, and you can find all of the details on the screen. And thank you so much, Loretta and Marsha, for joining me today and talking about a very important program here in the Mojave Atwa service area. Thank you. Thank you for watching Wellness for Life. 
brought to you by Back in Motion Physical Therapy, Gottenborg Chiropractic Clinic, Mahabi Atwa Community Action Partnership, Lakeside Sports and Pain Clinic, and Thomas and Swanson and Zahn Attorneys at Law.